word design has never been about making more chair lamps or tables but more to improve life yes so to look at the future of mobility or the future of health or the future of energy and to realize that old system is crashing and to come up with new ideas and new proposals is i think the role of the designer uh, and that's fascinating you know there has never been more than ever a desire for new ideas for new behavior I'm flying to Beijing tomorrow for our uh, most recent project, uh, the Smog Free Project, where we're sort of building this gigantic electronic vacuum cleaner to suck up the smog locally, uh, therefore creating the cleanest park in Beijing. To create a place where people can experience the future, uh, which is air pollution free, and it's sort of a park of 50 by 50, 40 by 40 meters, uh, which is 75% more clean than the rest of the city. And therefore, we're creating a sort of, yeah, sort of hotspot, sort of blue zone, uh, where people can experience uh, the future, in my opinion. So I want to move away from this fact sheet discussion. And that will hopefully create an incentive to make the whole city uh, smog free, yeah? that people work together to make that uh, happen. And, and, and it's a radical project with many ups and downs, but uh, we're getting there. And uh, it, 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 it's exciting to use design to improve life and to actually take something polluted, something troublesome, and actually um, uh, drag it into something uh, which is of the new, a collective experience. I've always been fascinated with making things which connect the virtual and the real world together, and, and to make things which are open or interactive for the people around them. Pieces like June or Sustainable Dance or the Smart Highway that we recently launched, are about landscapes of the future, uh, energy neutral and at the same time incredibly poetic. This combination is, I, I think, important. The first smart highway that we realize right now are paints which charge at daytime and give light at night. Uh, to think about landscapes which are energy neutral and on the other hand, um, yeah, just incredibly beautiful. And uh, last Monday it has been um, matured, so to speak. It's been uh, uh, proven. Um, and it's been great, you know, we had sort of local traffic jams popping up in that location. Um, and now we have a lot of uh, people from abroad, from China, India, uh, Qatar, etc., who are coming by to have a look. And, and they also would like to have it in other countries. So it's a great collaboration with a road manufacturer, Heimans, where you see that the artists and the industry can work together to make things which look unrealizable in the beginning but are actually uh, absolutely necessary if we want to make uh, uh, f uh, cities of the future.